overnight lows tonight. Comfortable in northern Oklahoma, 60s, 70s down to the south. What can you expect for your morning commute other than a few light rain showers hit and miss? Temperatures are going to be mainly in the 70s. Your commute will more than likely be just fine out there. As again, the rain will be fairly light and more than likely coming to an end by 9 o'clock. So for tonight, 20% chance of rain, 71 degrees. We'll keep a 20% chance of rain at 8 a.m. Mid 70s, we are dry and warm, but not hot. As we go in towards noon, 84 degrees and a high tomorrow, only 89 degrees. Last week of July is traditionally a very hot week for us, where our average highs are usually easily getting into the mid 90s. And and 100, but not for tomorrow. Look at this: only 85 in Enid, 87 in Stillwater, 89 in Oklahoma City. Look at this: nowhere in the entire state of Oklahoma are we seeing 90 degree temperatures for tomorrow. As we go in towards tomorrow afternoon, low in chance of a few isolated showers out in western Oklahoma, and some of those coming up just in towards western parts of the metro. But again, I expect most of us will stay dry. Big story again: Oklahoma cool down coming in here, where temperatures are going to remain 10 to 20 degrees below normal, especially as we go into the middle of the week here. Look at this drop in temperatures. These are afternoon high temperatures. And look, this is where we should be. And we're likely only going to be getting down into the lower 70s. Wednesday will be the coolest day all week. Temperatures come up by the end of the week, but they're still well below average. Not only that, also getting a fair amount of rain coming in here as well. 80 to 100% chance of storms from Guymon through Woodward. And that even includes Oklahoma City as we go into Wednesday. How much rainfall widespread for now? One to two inches of rain across much of the state. Isolated areas, especially between Woodward and Clinton, near four inches. So ceiling, Fairview, even down towards around Elk City, yeah, up towards almost four inches of rain coming in here, especially as we go in towards the middle of the week. So, nice amount of rainfall coming in here. That will help keep the grass green and keep the fire threat very low. So, 89 degrees for a high tomorrow, 89 for Tuesday. Look at that drop in temperatures for Wednesday, 80% chance of storms, 77 on Thursday, 83 on Friday. This might be the best looking. Five day forecast that we have seen all year long. Let's go into the next five days and take you in towards next week. The weekend's looking pretty nice, whether you are going to be doing any type of golfing, hanging out by the lakes, because notice how temperatures, even towards the beginning of August, stay below average. And again, below average temperatures in the summertime feel pretty good.